Hello, and welcome to another uh, Sunless Guys Let's Play episode. Um, we're on episode six. Uh, I realized that I previously misstated how many episodes in we were, so we're not quite as far as I thought we were along, but um, but now we are on episode six, and it's exciting. Um, so today we're going to try to get to find Lustrum. Um, maybe a quick stop in Carillon, although uh, maybe I will kind of try to get down over here, just north of New Winchester, and see about, um, see if it's up here, because it could really be anywhere in this space, uh, and it's a little scary, because, um, uh, I don't know, it's like, fuel-wise, we're gonna hit a point where we're going to be burning a lot of it, um, which is why I, I'm half tempted to go to New Winchester first, and I'll try to unload some of this. We have some of this junk in our hold. Like, now I can't really do anything with these sacks of verdant seeds or this crate of nostalgic crockery. Um, and I'd like to dump it, but no one will buy it in Port Prosper. But, I don't know. Four fuel, four supplies. Let's strike out, see what we can do. Um, I'm actually going to go south. Actually, though, I do need to get repaired, so maybe that's the thing to do this episode. We'll go over to New Winchester, and then we'll strike out from there, um, heading to the north. Um, if that's what we want to do, this is definitely the right way to go. We do have enough money that we can afford to kind of burn a little bit of, of, of resources getting there. Um, that guy looked scary. And, oh, great. There we go. Well, now we're repaired, though, so. Oh, shit. I didn't really mean to. That was a tackety ship. Oops. I thought it was a pirate. Oh, well. So it goes. You do what you do. Maybe we'll end up being a supporter of the stovepipes, the people who are not good, it seems like. But I don't know. Did I lose a bunch of standing, do you think, with Attackities? No, I still have... Still have 29 with Attackities. So it's fine. I don't want to fall too far with the stovepipes because I want to be able to go to these ports and not be harassed by stovepipe locomotives, you know? So, it's kind of why I want to play both sides a little bit. And now that we're, now that I've kind of had that, yeah, bring my terror down, let's hang out here for a second. Okay, cool. Love that thing. Now that I have that much haul, I'm going to kind of see about going around uh, the this area, the north of New Winchester. Because we have the Settler um, to take there. And I have one crate of munitions, so I can at least sell that um, to make a bit of cash. And then from there, try to figure out where we can buy crates of munitions. Um, which may just come down to needing to explore some. I don't know. Uh, let's see where this leads. Is this just a dead end? It is. And there's always Carillon kind of in the orbit of where we're at, so um, I can always go there. I just don't think they sell fuel, um, if I recall. Uh, they just have supplies, which is a little, ugh. Uh, but the sky closes its jaws about you. Water freezes in the pipes. Engineers scurry to and fro with boiling kettles. Bit of flavor is really cool. Excuse me. Little bits of snow going around. Let's see. Uh, so let's uncover this stuff. Another thing. <laughs> I don't know what to do with that garbage. I don't really want it. <laughs> That's fine. I watch. It'll end up selling for like a shitload of money in, in New Winchester or something. So, and then I'll feel stupid for not wanting it. Uh, in the interest of kind of getting this place explored, I am going to come down here a little bit. Not for two... Woo! There are scary monsters here! 
I'm gonna leave now. Remember last episode I asked if there were gonna be monsters? Well, there's a monster. Oh, the sounds it makes are creepy. Hopefully the lustrum isn't like right there. Although that would be very close, so I doubt it. Very quiet now. After we saw those gross monsters. Okay. I don't like that at all. This place is fucked up. This place is really spooky. But these ruins are always beautiful. Once were they were unsettling and eerie. One of the more disturbing land parks in the wilderness. Don't linger here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Ah, fuck. I went the wrong way. Jesus. Okay, I'm leaving. But I'm leaving, though. Oh, my God. I don't I don't know what the best so we can't get that way. Fuck. This is really, really rough. And unsettling. So I guess it's not north of New Winchester this way. How about we just head down to New Winchester itself and reconnoiter. I'm going to have to go back past another one of those things. But hopefully it's engaged with that marauder. Oh, that was really unsettling. Scary. Sir Scribe Spinster. Fuck. No, I don't want to fight you guys. Shit. Jesus. I don't want anything to do with them. God. Engine's headlights glow like a ghost on the mist icy mists. Yeah. Oh. These things fucking whatever. I don't even care anymore. I'll go past the weird penis fish things. Those scribe splinters are scary. Incognito princess is delighted. I had doll's house this size. Much prettier, of course. A homestead. I don't really want to do either of these things. A little bit of reduction in terror, at least. Christ mighty God. So I guess when they say north of New Winchester, they don't mean over there. Because that is unsettling. But cool. I mean, it's cool that there's... <laughs> it's cool that there's stuff that can kind of make my hair stand up like that. Uh, even in a, in a setting where... Um, in a setting like this. Um, where I'm, you know, it's top down. And not really a horror game by any... By any stretch. Uh, okay. Yeah. Almost there. And, hey, you know, we found more... We uncovered more of the map up there, you know? Um, I almost wonder if this game would benefit from some form of fast travel kind of thing where you're... Ooh, Unsettled Dreams. The night your sleep is peppered with the uncomfortable dreams. The sky of your dream is, bla is of blazing gold. It is peppered, no crowded with suns. Suns piled on suns, like the groats in a miser's hoard. Their light floods you. It shines through the skin and bone and meat, exp 
pricking out your branching veins and slender pillars of your bones. There's no is there more to you is there no more to you than this? You wake. Um see company conversation tea, perhaps a biscuit. Uh those fundamental human things that help forget moments like this. Success! Good, okay. Familiar things. You find someone in the galley. They couldn't sleep either. You exchange a bleary greeting, a stiff of pot tea, a stiff pot of tea, <laughs> uh, and a conversation about the overflow valves. Already your dreams seem distant and silly. Cool. Taste of smog, the sound of iron on iron. We are home. That's... I don't want to go there. I want to go to New Winchester. Does this... Yeah, I think there's a path north under there. So maybe we'll be able to go out this way <laughs> and not go back to the desolation of Saliba, which is horrifying. Admiral's trying to crockery for Port Avon. Okay. Well. Aid the stovepipe's war efforts, though. I don't really know that I want to do that. So. No, I want to just so Okay, so this is where we can bank stuff. And I can sell this stuff. Okay, cool. So now we're at five. I actually think I want to buy one more of each. Oh, that would put me over my whole hold limit. So, um, yeah, maybe I'll buy one more fuel. Uh, and then is there anything I need to put in the bank? No. Abraham's engineering. So here we go. So we can look. I think it's probably worthwhile to upgrade something on our on our locomotive. So we have another small armament slot. Um, that's enough. This little pop buck here. Uh, plus four quarters. I don't really feel the need for more crew yet. Um, mining. There was there's mining at some point. Interesting. That gives you butchery, additional cargo bay. So a lot of this is too expensive though. Um. I think I'd like to put a second gun on the ship. Ah, but I don't have hold for it. So I got to go to the bank, drop munitions and storage so that then I can buy a second gun. Stick that here. You're such a whiner. <laughs> Special guest. <laughs> um... And so let's see. Auxiliary slot, plating slot, bridge slot. So this is really expensive. I like the idea of having more armor, but I don't really want to dip down yet. Uh, so instead, I'm just going to go back to the bank, put this back in my hold. And then I, I need to get repaired is the only other thing. Um, repair your locomotive. There we go. What are we at? 45 versus 30. Yeah, we'll just spend it. Get the hull back. Um, oh, hello. Are you excited about the locomotive? Are you excited to go sailing the, the skies? <laughs> okay. 
Um, let's see. Is there so we got a uh, oh a tattered poster by the station advertises the services of a Mister Menagerie purveyor of fine scouts. Uh, we do already have a scout. Um, a ratronaut. Those are good. Well, we have, we have a we have a star smitten bat. Um, ah, up to three discoveries before returning. Cool. Um, okay, so we're not gonna get anything for now. So he's going to leave. Strategy nods its head. We are moving elsewhere soon, but we will leave a note saying where we have gone. We will have more things to show and stories to tell. It turns away, humming an eerie tune to itself as it gathers up its things for the next leg of its journey. Uh, I could do an opportunity to respond to a distress call. I don't know that... I kind of just want to get... Well, yeah, why not? A group of concerned Tackities are looking for a Skyfair captain to assist in retrieving a missing friend. Captain, a broad-shouldered Tackity speaks for the group. A friend of ours. There are, pro there are protests. An acquaintance of ours has sent a message from Hybris. She needs to transport back to, need, she needs to, transport back to New Winchester. He pauses for a breath. Would you mind picking her up if you happen to go out that way? She's a filmmaker. Goes by Madame Lumiere. She, she said she'd never return, so I have to assume she's taken ill. It'd be good to make sure she gets back safely. Hey, yeah, a good reason to go to the southeast at some point. Definitely. Um, how goes the war? Slow burning war for the Reach forms the backdrop to daily life in New Winchester. Citizens wishing to keep up with the developments in the war turn to the New Gazette. It is famously the only newspaper worth reading in New Winchester, as well as the only paper that has bank hasn't bankrupted itself. Its quality speaks for itself. Um... Search the new gazette to look for her name. Your name does not appear in any of the tackety focused reporting on the war. Apparently, you are not considered worthy of comment. There's no mention of you among the stories about the stovepipe's recent fortunes. You are of no interest to them. That's fine. Let's keep it that way. Read about the latest news. All work at Victory Hall has been stalled by a measure introduced by the prudent secretary of the Windward Company attempting to regulate the materials of engines. The company will accept trade with and from. It is widely believed the measure is an attempt by the company to force the assembly to reveal the part, their part in supporting the practice of illegal engine construction from salvage taken from wrecked locomotives. The slow burning, uh, yeah. Let's read about the current political situation. The assembly runs New Winchester from the Victory Hall and seeks to strengthen its hand in the reach. London's proxy, the Windward Company, however, maintain a considerable presence in the reach. Although New Winchester is still neutral ground, ground tensions are mounting within and without the port. Okay, um, so let's go turn in these port reports. <laughs> Almost banging into things there. Um, Victory Hall. I still like working with the Tackities in that respect. I wonder if there's any time limit on ugh, um, on this one. Hopefully not. Because I would prefer to go up and find Lustrum first to deliver the settler and then go down there. Visit Victory Hall. Deliver your port reports to the Endurant Veteran. I'd rather know than not, I suppose. And thank you for bringing this to me. Rather than the bloody stovepipes, I'll arrange a gratuity. Hey, 200 sovereigns. Very cool. Uh, I don't really want to spend any of this stuff yet. Now, can I please... Okay, I can go under here. I was worried I wasn't going to be able to go under there. Uh, what is this? Is this the like the company spot? Company house. Okay. So here is where you would go if you wanted to gain 
stovepipe uh, stuff, which at some point we may want to, because again, I don't really want to take a side, so. Got no issues with you, Tackety. Got two guns now. I am interested to see. I don't want to be near them when I fire them, but I want to. Okay, so you left and that's great. You left and right click for your two different guns, which is cool. It still takes up heat, though. Yeah, I can fire both at once if you double click. Um, yeah, we're gonna not go over there. Hopefully, I really hope it's not like up there or something. The lustrum. I can't imagine it would be though. Unless all that stuff is procedural, too. Which, who knows, I guess. Okay, so we're linking up with that passage. Was close to the Mother of Mountains. The sky grows cold. Your crew donned coats and gloves. Stay warm. Yeah, so this is the direction I want to head in. What's all this? Oh. Scary fish monsters. Jesus. I don't, let's, I mean, I, I guess, I don't want to fight these Tackities, though. Oh, okay. He's dead. So those aren't so bad. I mean, who knows what happens if they hit you, but. Cantankery, Cantankery, placated. The Cantankery are lumbering, half-fossilized isopods that will attack anything they disapprove of. Given that they are very ancient and murderously grumpy, that means almost everything. The corpse of the Cantankery has been neatly sheared, creating a clear cross-section of its internal arrangements. Praise precious, prize precious stones from its carapace. Uh, retrieve a stony organ. Ugh, I don't want to risk losing crew. Um, yeah, okay, so you could get some supplies off of them. That's cool. If we had a cannery on the thing. So instead, just do this. Partial success. 27 sovereigns, that's not bad. For, for that little bit of work. Hauling the creature alongside your locomotive, you deploy hammers and pry bars there. Valuable stones glimmer amidst the worlds of uncanny fossils. The fossils shape... Shapes are sinuous and predatory, preserved for unknown eons in the cantankery sony skin. Alright. So they call that... I mean, I guess that's pretty directly northwest. I wonder if it's just up here somewhere. That would suck if we had to go through there to get to it. Hopefully there's a route up and around or something. See, I'm just seeing if there's anything I can get from talking. Gambling. Uh, I don't really want to do that. And I need two Tales of Terror to talk to him. Okay. Ooh, that's cool looking. Very cool looking. Shards of, like, ice crystals. I'll just send out the bat. Mm. Well, let's go see what this question mark is. Oh, that's all. Interesting. Interesting. 
The Wanderlust. Fucking hell. Every goddamn time I fail, even though I have great iron. 77% chance. I mean, I have... I had almost full crew, so... Whatever, but... I honestly don't know yet what crew gives you. Yep, so this is another this is still a route north. Feels like we're getting pretty close to the edge of the ring to this to be where Lustrum is. But I don't really want to send the bat out again because I'm a little concerned about supplies. We're actually hitting the limits where I'm going to need to call it and go back. Yeah, this is like the edge, the edge. But it looks like we can scoot around to the to the west here, which is the direction we need to go. So. So I'm just thinking, it can't be, unless it's down in here, but it can't be much further if it's being said that it's north of New Winchester. It's got to be around here. I really don't want to go back to the desolation of Seba or whatever that's called, Saliba. But I don't know that we're going to have a ton of choice. Ruitz Ridge. Oh, there's something over here. This is a mining place, I bet. You gotta... Yep. Yep. So these are rocks you could mine. That's kind of cool. Dark, quiet, spooky. Ours are mined in lustrum. Good for going faster than possible. Going to get some. Hey! Looks like we found our spot. Sweet. Lustrum. We're relieved to see land, perhaps unwisely. Whoops. Dinged my hall there. Frantic, hustling, heart of lustrum crammed with prospectors, peddlers, and purveyors of essential and occasionally legal services. Most business takes place here unless you're a dreamer seeking your fortune on the claim fields. Ooh, I'm, I do need a navigator. That's good. Do, don't I? I have a signaler, an engineer, a first officer, and I'm, I don't... First officer, okay. No. I got the princess already. So I have one to sell so far. I sell verdant seeds. Seeds. Good, I can buy fuel and supplies here. Um... Interesting. So, but I have delivering a settler. I'm delivering the settler here, so I don't really know. I'd like to be able to do that first. Maybe. No, I don't want to do that yet. Maybe it's under Explore Lustrum? Drop of Settler. Here we go. You're here. They arrived at the destination. Whether or not they still wish to be here is another matter entirely. You've made good time. They should reward you well. Lustrum sings its own song. The mines ring. The caverns howl. The machines roar. The settler pauses beside you before disembarking. He goes to speak, but thinks better of it. He pays you and is off. Sweet. Hey, that's great. Almost leveled up. 
we got a bunch of money. Um, that's a good way to make some money. Um, now I would like to go to Sweet Jane's Counting House. Uh, this is going to be a good thing to end on. A little accountancy firm snuggled in the snowy drifts. Sweet Jane oversees everything herself. The transference of funds, the balancing of probabilities, the transport of commodities, the, trans the termination of contracts. She is huddled behind her desk, swaddled in a ma monstrously ugly red scarf. While she fiddles with her abacus with one gloved hand, she heats the other over a little coal fire. Her one good eye focuses on you. She smiles. Listen to her offer. She limps to the window. Snow batters the window pane. The shadow of the mountain is all but lost in the blizzard. The lantern light means the offices of the Windward Company are just about visible. I was raised by the company. Children are faster workers, you understand. Her fingers drum on the windowsill. Such a waste. Where they see men, they see labor. Where they see time, they see chains with, it, with which to bind us. But where they see death in the skies, I see victory. She returns it to you and smiles. Bring me nameplates torn from London ships. I will see you adequately compensated. I'm not going to do that. Sweet Jane turns back to the window and stares at the dizzying snow. Understand on this matter. I have no pride. It is too important. The offer will be open if you change your mind. Okay, so that's where we can go to, to sell some London stuff. Uh, it's interesting. You could... T I feel like you could get into... Uh, mining in this even like and and make that a thing you spend a lot of time on which i'm not going to do this playthrough but uh i'm going to write a port report so much for the quiet retirement village that used to be here the rush of prospectors has ripped the civility from the place as effectively as efficiently as the geodes from the mountainside the scars that remain are no less vivid fewer and fewer prospectors prospectors return with geodes of ours and the cost of processing them off-site grows every day. Still for now, Lustrum thrives and offers the promise of riches for any lucky or industrious miner willing to come and risk everything in the snow and the mud. Really, really cool. Uh, we're going to end it there today. I am more excited than I have been yet to continue to play this game. Um, next time, we're going to maybe explore some of this stuff around the desolation of Saliba without trying, to, trying not to get in it. Might try to get this area uh, explored a bit more. And then we're going to be off to the southeast to um, to fulfill that other mission that we got from the Tackadies in New Winchester. Um, super excited to keep playing. Uh, thank you for joining me, and make sure to check out everything else on the Fix YouTube channel. There's a lot of cool stuff going up. Thanks.